Hello everyone and welcome to today's episode. I hope you're all enjoying your summers. It's been really nice and hot this summer so I hope you've been getting out to enjoy the sun and play. I know sometimes when it's really really hot all we want is for some rain to help cool things down so we don't have to stay inside to avoid the heat. Well, unfortunately, we can't control the weather, but today we're gonna to be making two crafts. One's gonna help us enjoy the sun, and the other is gonna help us when we wish for rain. Let's get started. For our first craft, we'll need wax paper, white glue, many colors of tissue paper, an old paintbrush, a pencil, some scissors, water, some double-sided tape, and an old cup. For our second craft, we'll need a paper towel roll, aluminum foil, uncooked rice, some markers, scotch tape, two sheets of construction paper, something with a round handle, a broom handle, and scissors. Okay, so our first craft that we're gonna make today is tissue paper sun catchers. So the first step is to grab your tissue paper scraps. You're gonna grab your scissors and you're just gonna cut these into little bits. And you're gonna wanna do this with all the tissue paper that you have. All right, once you've got all your tissue paper pieces cut up, Let's just move them out of the way to the side while we do our next step. For this step, you're gonna to wanna to grab your piece of wax paper. Just make a sheet about the length of a sheet of paper and then I'm just gonna hold it here and I'm gonna get my scissors and cut along the edge. Let's tip this upside down so that part that curves is facing downward so it doesn't curl up on us when we're using it. The next step is you're gonna to wanna to get your cup and your glue, and you're gonna to wanna to put, about cover the bottom of your cup in glue. Once that is all covered in glue, you're just gonna to wanna to add water. So however much glue you add, you wanna add half the amount of your glue in water. There you go. And you're gonna stir it up with your paintbrush. Next, let's put this glue over here and you're gonna get some on your paintbrush and spread a thin layer across your wax paper. Okay, now the fun part. We're gonna start taking pieces from our pile of tissue paper and laying them onto the paste. So get ready to have some sticky fingers. And once you have a piece down, you're just gonna brush over it again with the paste. So let's do that with the rest of our tissue paper. Okay, now that we're done this little collage, we're gonna set this inside until it is completely dry. While we're waiting for that to dry, let's get started on our rain stick. So the first thing you're gonna need for your rain stick is two sheets of aluminum foil. The first one should be a little bit longer than your paper towel tube that you're gonna use. And your second sheet, you want it to be about half the size or a little bit more than your first sheet. So, you're gonna want to wrap this, twist it up, roll it up until it resembles a stick like this. Then you're gonna get your broom handle and you're going to wanna wrap it around to make a spiral. You have your first spiral. Then you're gonna wanna get your second piece and twist it up like we did the first one, but you're gonna wanna make it, it's gonna be a little thinner. And then you're gonna wanna get the handle of whatever you're using for your inside shape and do exactly like we did with the broom handle. Okay, so now we have our two spirals. We can move them out of the way. Then we're gonna need our paper towel roll and our pencil. You're gonna wanna get your sheet of construction paper 
place it on to the piece of construction paper and draw a circle around the end. And I'm gonna do this twice, once for each end. Then you're gonna make bigger circles around your smaller circles. So make almost like a donut shape. And then we're gonna cut them out. Then you're gonna wanna take your scissors in your circle and you're gonna wanna make lots of little cuts towards the middle of it so that it can bend, but it doesn't go all the way to the center. And do that all the way around both pieces. Get your tape. You're gonna wanna take these pieces and start taping them down to the end of your cardboard. Once one end is completely covered, you wanna put it this way and grab your first spiral and put it in. And then get your second spiral and put it in. Then you're just gonna wanna add a little bit of rice until the tube is about that high with rice. Okay. Our next step is to take this other piece and do what we did before. So we're just gonna tape this on. Okay, now that we have both ends done, you're gonna wanna get a sheet of construction paper. I'm gonna use the same color I did for the ends. You're gonna get your pencil and just make a little line right at the end of your rain stick. You're gonna get your scissors, cut off that edge, then you're going to want to tape this bit down and roll it all the way around. Now the best part. Let's get our markers and decorate. Okay, you can do whatever designs you like. So, and that is our rain stick done. Now that we're done with that, the base for our sun catcher should be just about dry. Now, we're gonna carefully peel off our tissue paper. And now, you can cut whatever shapes you like. I am gonna do hearts. You're gonna grab your pencil and just do a little outline of whatever shape you want to do. And then you're going to want to cut. Let's make a few more. The last step is to get some double-sided tape. Take a small piece and put it across your sun catcher. All right, let's go put these on the window. Thanks for watching today's art adventures. Before we go, let's hear how our rain stick turned out. Wow, it sounds just like rain. If you liked today's video, make sure to watch tomorrow's video for more awesome crafts. If you followed along with today's video, be sure to ask your parents to send a picture of your craft to art at and include your first name and age to be featured on our website.